Hello. In this video, I will show you how to use a program called Zamzar to convert streaming video, like the kind you see in YouTube, to something that can be saved on your desktop. So to start with, find the video or the media that you want to convert. I am using this French Revolution video that I found on YouTube. It's actually the Dis Discovery Education History Channel uh, French Revolution video. All you have to do to start is copy the URL that you see in this box here. And you can do that by clicking on Edit and then clicking Copy or just using Control c The next step is going to the Zamzar website, which you can link to from the blog. When you get to Zamzar, you have two choices in finding a file. You can click Browse and pick something from your desktop or from anywhere on your computer to convert. Or you can click URL and it will take you to a page where you can put the URL that you copied from YouTube into Zamzar. And you can do that. I just clicked Control V. You can also do Edit and Paste. The next step is telling Zamzar what kind of file you'd like it converted to. You can use Windows Media Viewer. You can use um, QuickTime files. You can use iTunes files. You can It'll convert to a number of different files. So you just select what you want it to do, and then you put in your email address. The way that Zamzar works is that it'll convert it, and then it sends you an email with the link to where you can download the file. Once you have your email address in there, you just click Convert. It will verify what you're asking it to do, and you click OK. If you notice up here where the tab for Zamzar is, it starts to turn into a progress bar. It tells you how far the um, upload of the file is going. Once it's around 100, it, you can start to expect your email to come that in that amount of time. Um, sometimes it ranges from a couple of minutes that Zamzar will send you the email with the link. Sometimes it'll take a couple of hours. Zamzar does offer paid uh, memberships, those paid memberships say that they will send things faster and you can do more with them, but I have always used a free membership and haven't had any problems with it. Once you do get the email from Zamzar, uh, it will come with a link. And you can see right here that there's a link right here. Once you click the link, it will take you to a Zamzar page where you'll see this download now button. You can either open it or save it and it defaults to save wherever you have it designated. Mine will save on my desktop. So depending on your connection speed, it will download to your computer. I already have this file downloaded. Then you can open it up and you've got a copy of whatever you were using on YouTube to use however you need to use it for your class. It's really nice if you are having problems with your bandwidth or with your internet connection at school. Sometimes ours goes out, so it's nice to have a, something like Zamzar that can convert your YouTube files or whatever you're using into something that you can always have access to.